um, having only three players involved in the, the Four Nations will massively benefit us. I think we all get Roger due back in early November, so we'll get a good three months before the season starts. And I can't remember ever getting three months prep. Um, certainly can't remember having the majority of the group for any length of time, so uh, be a massive benefit, certainly for um, well for everybody involved, for our younger end, but certainly for our older end. Yeah, it was really hard, probably the toughest decision I've had to make, but um, you know, I have, I have no doubt I could still play at that level, and, and um, even now, um, with the team getting ready to, to fly out, you still feel a part of you, um, could be out there, and uh, certainly be looking forward to the challenge but I think at some stage you've got to make a call and um, you use that word retirement and you, and you think that's it it's all over but hopefully by making that decision it it uh, prolongs my, my Leeds career and um, I think body wise um, I needed more time to recover after the World Cup uh, not just physically but, but probably mentally as well and I've only had 10 days off and starting training and then when we came back in in January, having actual 12 days on the field with the boys before our first friendly, just just weren't enough time. So, um, and I'll be going in, into 2015 bouncing. Um, can't wait for it. Um, I think the 2012 grand final, just because we came from fifth again. Uh, we were playing against Warrington, who had beat us in the cup final, and um, everybody doubted us, and and uh, and I was just just a, a really enjoyable game. I uh, hope to play for another two years, um, but I suppose we'll address that as we go and, and see where I'm at. Um, I'm not sure what the future brings, to be honest. Um, you know, I, I think I'd love to be a part of the club going forward, um, but again, we'll have to see what the future brings. Um, you know, I, at this moment in time, I, coaching is not something that I really fancy, so... Um, we'll have to see. Um, uh, there'll be a couple, um, certainly internationally there's been some greats. Um, but I'd have to say I've been playing with them for so long, there'll be probably before, there'll be JP, Jonesy, Rob and Danny. Um, difficult to separate them because they're all very special in their own right, but um, them four would get in any team in the world. Um, a seven year old turning up at very wet and windy, muddy, water red amateur club um, ground and um, getting thrown into an under nines training session. Uh, it was pretty daunting at the time but um, to start of something pretty special. I'm not quite sure. I'd, I don't think there's anybody I dislike playing. I like the challenge every week. Um, the team I'd like to draw in the Challenge Cup every year has been Oldham. So I've never had to get to play against my hometown club in a competitive game but I'd, you know, I'd love for Leeds to draw Oldham next year and um, I think that'd be really special. No, it's no real secret. It's just uh, just trying to keep myself relaxed. So, a couple of pointers: uh, relax, head down, and follow through. Not that it probably means much to anybody, but uh, they're the three things I say to myself.